Um, the Jaguars signed their second quarterback for the season, and his name is Mike Glennon. Didn't go the Cam Newton route. No, they didn't, which lets me know that they do not care one iota about winning this season. Um, you sign Mike Glennon, that's waving a white flag. That's 100% what that is. I Especially, like Minshew a lot, but I think they're in tank mode. Yeah. Uh, Jose jumped in on YouTube, said Denver running the AFC, you lock that in. Uh, well, I, we know the Jaguars are not. I know that. And our, our boy Sam will agree with you. Michael on uh, on Twitch, who's usually in here, uh, he would agree with you as well. We got a lot of Denver fans that jump in on the show. Listen, I'm a, listen, I like Denver. Last year, I bet a lot of Denver. I'm a, I'm, I'm a Denver pro Denver guy. Yeah, we're also big time fans. running Fangio the fans. AFC. Brother, you, I know the weed is good up there, but you don't have to smoke at all. It's, it, don't forget, you still got my homes in the division. I mean, that's just crazy. Uh, <laughs> Monster X Gaming said, Why is Cam still not going to the Pats? Uh, because the Pats don't want him. Don't want him. That's he can't it. throw the football. He's not accurate. Yeah. Bill Belichick will not have somebody play quarterback for him that can't throw the football accurately. Yeah. All your other abilities are nice. If you can't do the one thing he needs you to do at quarterback, he doesn't care about all the extra. Yeah. Jose said the uh, the Chiefs D sucks. I didn't need it last year. Just saying. You know? <laughs> and then on top of that, Monster X Gaming said uh, Cam's choices are getting closed one by one. I'm 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 really yeah. worried about Cam. I'm really worried about Cam. I'll tell you this: I wouldn't be upset if he went to the Denver. I really wouldn't, because I think if they had an honest competition, I think I think he could win that job. I don't know, man. Drew Locke can throw the flip. I mean, he could fling that. That's thing. fine, but I'm, that's fine. I don't know that Drew is. This is a guy that got his ass burned by Baker last year. Okay. Go ahead, put all your eggs in Drew Locke because of a couple good games. No, I mean, I, I'm not saying yeah, put all your eggs in. I'm just saying I don't know. I don't think Cam necessarily wins the job. I think. I think. Okay, but at least I think he Locke's probably a better quarterback. Um, Joseph Gomez said, "Ed Glennon Hoyer still in the league. Nobody wants Kaepernick or give me at least a chance." Uh, look, the Kaepernick thing is done. Uh, he he doesn't want a job. How long believe. has it been since like, he's been in the league now? Four. We're four this seasons, will be five seasons? Four, four years? Five years? I don't know. Uh, hey, by the way, Jose said Cam should go to the Browns. Didn't the Browns sign Hoyer? No, uh, Case no. Keenum. Case Keenum. Yeah, they, right. they signed Keenum. They're not doing that either. Yeah, I think I think they're fine. Uh, McKinnon said Cam either sits the year out or signs to a team that has a big injury at quarterback at some point this season. I hope he goes to the Steelers. I'm not That's a big Cam Newton guy, but That's I think I this is the best spot. I, I know you don't want him to go there because you can't pull for him there, but... I'm going to tell you the place he needs to go, and this is the, this is the guy down the street. He needs to go to Buffalo. Buffalo really is a quarterback away from being exceptionally good. Yeah. And, or and, or and, he needs to go to uh, uh, the Chargers. Yeah. I, I mean, I, I think the Chargers, uh, they they want Herbert to win that job, and then Tyrod well, is, is You the want guy. one thing. Listen, I don't care. I, I, think, I think Buffalo I want to win, and I don't think Herbert's going to do it. I think Buffalo is is a good spot. I think uh, I think the quarterback. What, what's the quarterback's name up there? God bless uh, Josh Allen. Allen. Got, I kept wanting to say Love, and it's is that ain't it at all. Uh, no, he's Josh an Allen. Idiot. Um, no, I I think Cam could beat out Josh Allen. Oh um, yeah, there's no thinking to that. Yeah, I think there's a really good chance Fromm could beat out Allen if they let it be a fair quarterback competition. I just. I, <laughs> Monster X Gaming said, uh, uh, I want him to be like Fitz, a uh, big game player on many teams. Uh, and then he said, is Cam a Hall of Famer? Because I think he is. I, I don't know if he's a Hall of Famer. Not yet. He had, he's he got had one a monster MVP. season. He's got one MVP and one Super Bowl run. Does and he's that in the same Bowl. year. If you take that year out and take his worst year out, I don't know that he's close to being great. I, I don't think so either. I mean, he, he declined... He set so, much so many rookie records when he came in. He came in just on fire. Um, but but after that, until his MVP season, he was never anything special. Yeah. Uh, MVP year, he was unbelievable. But yeah. then he's never been close to that again. The Broncos uh, broke him. Ben said, I don't think Spanos cares. He'll do what he wants. Herbert wins the job. Well, that's just stupid. Yeah. That's, that and they'll you continue don't win. to be he's, awful. Yeah. Um, Monster X Gaming said he will eventually get there. He won't get chosen right away. Um, I mean, you got to get a team first. I mean, you got to find a team that's that's willing to let you play. 
and he ain't there yet. He said five to seven years after he retires, he's getting in. Maybe. I wonder uh, this. You know how every couple of years Aaron Rodgers gets hurt? If if he was to go down, do you think they would immediately go to Love? Or if Love's a project, do you bring a guy like Cam in there? I think you bring a guy like Cam in. I, Love is nowhere near so. ready. Nowhere near ready. I, see, I, I, I completely agree with that. Uh, Joseph Gomez said Rodgers to the Chargers if he forces his way out. Well, Rodgers got two years before they can let him go because the dead cap money would yeah. cripple the, the, the Packers. The pack, Packers. Uh, McKinnon said, oh, well. Matt on YouTube said uh, Cam's fashion choices will keep him out because even a blind gay man said it was too loud. Uh, and then McKinnon, <laughs> McKinnon said Cam needs to start eating meat again. Dude didn't start getting seriously injured constantly until he went vegan. Um, Not yeah. a scientist. No. And then uh, Monster X Gaming said R.I.P. Saquon Barkley's career. He's the next Barry Sanders. Poor guy. Uh, no, 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 no. He's, he's not, not close Barry to Barry. Barry no. played on terrible teams and was still great. And still respected. I- and still, I do not think I think Bark, Barkley is going to be okay, but I don't think he's going to be great. Yeah, I'm. Uh, I'm with you, boy. We were all over the place today. This is just crazy. Uh, as, cool. as far as Mike Glenn goes, um, yeah, white I, flag, I, white flag. That's all that means. Uh, the red Jaguars flag. Are not the gi- you bring in the ginger, you're raving the red flag. Yeah, because there's no, there's no reason to bring in somebody like that when there's so many better quarterbacks on the board. Um, you know, what day was it last week that we talked about aliens? Does Mike Glennon not make you believe that aliens are real and he's one of them? <laughs> you probably don't. Now, I am not a handsome guy, <laughs> but I don't look like a damn alien. Oh, uh, yeah. No, I'm with you. I'm with you. That, guy, just... that guy don't look natural. <laughs> no, he really don't. I, I'm I'm really surprised that he's still got a job. Like, it, it, it amazes It should let you know that if you are even – slightly competent in this league, you can get you it. you got to be yeah. willing to take no money. This is the problem that these other guys, Jameis had to sign for nothing, yeah. okay? Andy Dalton had to sign for nothing. We said, oh, we gave him a hometown discount. Really? Because I think $3 million might have been the best offer he was getting. Oh, 100%. Like, like Cam Newton's problem is he, he thinks, I got to make $20 million and I need to be the starter. And while I think he's probably worth that, and the team that should be shooting themselves in the face is the bears yeah and throw they just they just pissed away assets and locked up foals for two years when they could have cam for a ham sandwich <laughs> somebody needs to throw ryan pace into the river mckinnon said hell paxton lynch is better than glennon then he said throw some go as on youtube i don't said, know about that no i don't know about that i don't know Mike about glennon, that either Mike uh, Lennon played in the NFL games, starting games, and didn't do poorly. Uh, Joseph Gomez said, did a ginger hurt Chris when he was little? There's just no mercy. <laughs> oh, I love Andy Dalton. <laughs> I just, listen, this ain't got to do with this red hair. Have you seen the dude's face? Have you seen his head and neck yeah, and the way? He just looks if weird, If you man. look at South Park, the way South Park draws aliens, <laughs> and you look at Mike Lennon. It's the same man, thing. They, it's they a- look a whole hell of a lot of life. <laughs> Do you think maybe they got like well no they were drawing no oh, they were drawing them aliens before Mike Lennon was a thing before he was even at NC State right they were yeah. there but way before he was a thing this is <laughs> what a what a fun show today <laughs> this is unreal uh, Matt said the Cowboys took Dalton because they could go eight and eight and save twenty six million dollars I don't think Jerry's worried about eight and eight like he don't want to be eight and eight especially not in that division good gracious. Um, no, with that team, no, they should be much better than that. Yeah, especially in, in that division, I mean, you got you got five built-in that, wins. That Andy, I've, I said this the other day to a buddy of mine. He lost his shit on me. But I fully believe that Andy Dalton could take that team to 10 wins. Oh, I agree 100%. Wait, yeah. it, it, can you tell me the name? You know who it was? Well, yeah, yeah, yeah. It's, it's my boy Cam. That was at my house this morning. I should have brought this up. You should have told me beforehand. No, he 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 thinks Andy Dalton would be a backup on all thirty-two teams. That is insane. You know, know me; I'm a Red Rocket fan, man. Like I love love Andy Dalton. I think, I think, there's, a, still, I think there's a chance he might be the best quarterback on that team. I think I think he, if it was an honest he competition, which we rarely get in the NFL because we just hand guys the keys to the franchise for some unknown reason. If there was an honest competition, I I like Dak. I don't hate Dak. I like picking on him. I 
don't know that he's a lot better than Andy. Hey, we we got somebody in here. Uh, it looked uh, he may be a first timer. I don't recognize the name. Damian Estrada jumps in on YouTube. Said, "Screw Cam Newton. The Bears don't need a diva as quarterback. We need a Super Bowl MVP quarterback, which is Foles." I'm going to tell you, Chris is going to disagree with you. Uh, we, we've seen Foles not in Frank Reich's offense. He's not great. Just saying. I mean, we'll see. He could. The fact that Nick Foles won the Super Bowl, I, I, I don't, I don't handle that very well. That well, especially after he did nothing in the playoffs up until that Super Bowl. They did. I mean, they scored 15 points on three field goals against the, the Falcons. Pacers didn't punt. And and somehow, some way, I, I just that's that that will remain one of the great mysteries as to how that happened. 500 and some yards of offense. Up team touchdowns, did not punt the entire game. Yeah. And Nick Foles wins a fucking Super Bowl. <laughs> All right. We're going to close out on that note. You guys know what to do. Subscribe to the show on whatever platform you're watching on. You guys jumped in the chat, which, by the way, we hit over 100 chats again, 100 uh, chat messages, whatever. We appreciate you guys. You helped drive the show. This one was all over the place. That's okay. We love doing it. We love getting the questions. We love you guys driving the conversation. It's always a lot of fun. Share the show out with your friends. Uh, Damian Estrada wanted to just, he got in one last comment. Said Foles is a better quarterback than Wentz. Uh, we I don't disagree with that. We wouldn't disagree with that. Hang we on wouldn't now. disagree. Uh, Didn't disagree with that. Ben said, uh, Ben said, thanks, guys. Matt reminded everybody to avoid the murder hornets this weekend. We will be back on Monday. But until then, make sure you share out the show. Tell all your buddies about it. Make sure you are subscribed to whatever platform it is. We're also on any of your favorite podcast apps. Remember the name, Winning Cures Everything. Until then, make sure that you take care of yourselves, take care of each other, and we'll see you on Monday. Thanks for checking out Winning Cures Everything. If you want to keep up with us, hit subscribe on YouTube or your favorite podcast app. Visit the website at winningcureseverything.com or you can like us on Facebook or follow us at Winning Cures, at Gary WCE, or at Chris B. Giannini on Twitter. Share out the show, leave a nice review, and make sure to comment and tweet at us.